So you are asked questions and we expect answers. Uh, thank you very much for those questions. Very good questions. Number one was asked by a gentleman from the back. Thanks for the question. Why do we need a lot of questions in the bursary? Why do we need a lot of questions in the bursary allocation forms? Yeah, these questions are very necessary. We are speaking of a population of 10,000 students, 10,000 ladies and gentlemen. And bursary, what was provided for is just 40 to 50 students get this. So how do we cut down from 10,000 students to 40 students? This is through the best way we can, uh, through vetting in the best way we can. And these questions help the bursary allocation committee into vetting these people and really knowing deep issues concerning them. So questions are very important. And for our own sakes, I think we should even look on adding more questions to those forms in order to make this, this process bulletproof. Um, coming to the cartel question, ladies and gentlemen, cartels are not your friends. Cartel are not people you meet each and every day. Cartel are people who control school business and they are non-students. That is a very good question and I'll take an example of the tax shop. And I should really ask you students, are you really for integrity? Because you are approached by someone who is non-student, he asks you for your admission number and presents your name as the owner of the tax shop, then behind you he controls all the business. So it, it starts with us. Let us not harbor these cartels. So what are we going to do about them? Cartels are deeply rooted in the tax shop there, so this is what we want to do. Uh, each and every owner of a tax shop is given that tax shop for a one-year contract. And let's get how contracts work. Contract is an agreement between two parties. Signatures are signed, so it is one, a one-year contract that is previewed to review in six months. So this is what we're going to do about these cartels. And she has asked me why I've been there and I've not been dealing with them. I've been a school representative. I did not...